good to be back in uh, spring training here with the guys. Um, first week's been uh, it's been going really well, and um, but yeah, all right. Excited to get after again, play some games, and get going. You didn't get to play in front of uh, fans at all last year after spring training, anyway. What is what do you think it's gonna be like having you a few thousand in in the, in the park tomorrow? Yeah, I'm very very welcomed. Um, you know, on our end, uh, I'm really excited to have some people back and hopefully um, more as the season goes on. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, it'll be a be good be good to fr play in front of fans again. That's for sure. Take the next one from Eric Boland. Hey, DJ, just to, uh, to follow up on Dan's question, as players, what did you guys miss the most about not having fans in the stands? Uh, I would say just, um, you know, the adrenaline just wasn't there as much as a player. Um, you know, you kind of, uh, you know, go out for a stretch before the game and kind of get the juices flowing usually. and. When there's no one out there, um, you know, you, you really have to dig deep with your teammates and do it. And um, But I know just having the fans and, you know, at least some, I, I think it's going to, you know, I, I think it's just going to be good for, for this country and, and for people that watch baseball and follow baseball. It's, um, you know, it's just going to be good for the game and good for the country for sure. Take the next one from Brian Hoke. Hey, DJ. Uh, how do you improve on a season when you hit 364 and won a batting title? Uh, I mean, every every season's uh, every season's different. Um, you know, just because last year was, uh, you know, I played well last year doesn't mean anything going into this year. So, um, you know, obviously it's it's a big uh, confidence thing um, coming off a good year, but uh, at, this, at the same time, I'm not taking anything for granted. Brian, if you have a follow-up, just use uh, the raise hand function. I'll, I'll drop one more in here. DJ, you spent a lot of time here at Steinbrenner Field when things shut down last year. How much different is the vibe being back and, I guess, having some life in the building now? It's, it's been great to see everyone. Um, it's kind of a long off offseason, uh, so it's great to be, be around the guys playing baseball again. Um, you know, really can't beat it, and then, you know, having fans back and getting in the games again, it's, uh, you know, it's an exciting time for us, for sure. Meredith Morakovitz, you have the next question. Hi, DJ. Does anything change for you knowing that you now have the security and you'll be with the Yankees for many years to come? Uh, no, but I'm excited. I'm, I'm very excited, very excited to be part of the organization, and, um, you know, but no, not, I mean, not, not a whole lot changes. Um, just getting back after it. What does it mean to you that you will be part of the organization for many years to come? Yeah, it's, it's exciting. I mean, it's, uh, you know, it's a, two of my most fun years, uh, you know, in 19 and 20. And, um, you know, to have the opportunity to do that six more years, it's, uh, it's exciting and, um, you know, honored to be part of this organization for sure. And can you just describe what your off season was like as you were waiting to find out whether or not you were going to be able to work out a deal with the Yankees? Uh, yeah, it was you know it was a long off season, but uh, I'm I'm glad it all worked out. Um, couldn't be more excited, and um, you know just excited to be back down here again. We'll take the next one from James Wagner. Hey DJ, what's up? Football's well. Uh, two two related questions. I guess. Uh, do, do you miss signing autographs? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, I, I mean, I'm, I'm glad, you know, people are going to be back in the stands, you know, watching the games, but, um, uh, you know, de definitely, you know, spring training is usually a time where there's a lot of, a lot of people get to kind of see the, you know, the work, um, you know, in the backfields and, and um, on the field before the game and stuff like that. So um, it's definitely different. I miss that still. And um, hopefully we get that back, uh, you know, sooner, sooner rather than later. And, and I guess away from the field because you're still a human being, like by the supermarket or even when you're flying here or whatever. What did people still ask you for autographs? Or did you like enjoy? Did you, had you missed that and signing those balls, like whatever it was I had? Did, did you like, yeah. miss that when you um, were Yeah, no, I, I, you know, I definitely, I definitely miss that. Um, but uh, I, I feel like people in general are kind of, you know, still in the COVID mindset um, with kind of, you know, asking for autographs and pictures and stuff. So. 
um, you know, it's like, it's not always my favorite thing to do, but I know how much it means and, um, you know, it's something I look forward to, you know, hopefully that kind of interaction returns. Sweeney Murdy, you have the next question. Hey, DJ, I uh, heard you say a couple of times here that you're excited to be back, you're excited to have fans with stands. It's hard to see that with you because you control your emotions so well. What are some of the things or maybe some of the times where you, know, you kind of let go of that a little bit and people see you really get excited? Yeah, you know, it's it's um, to, to me it's just Major League Baseball with, with fans. Um, last year, you know, I'm glad we played. Um, I'm glad we were able to get in as many games as we we could, and I thought the playoffs was was cool. But um, yeah, I mean, I just I just I, I you know, I just miss miss that adrenaline, that excitement. Um, you can definitely tell um, how how excited people are to, to go to baseball games, and, and you know, especially to watch the Yankees, and um, and that's what that's what I'm excited about. It, I enjoy I enjoy the game, but I, like I said, I know how much it means to. To, to a lot of fans to, to watch the Yankees and to watch baseball close up.